and he goes into the second round as your points leader in 2010, Chris Borich! There you go, cowboy. I'm sure you felt like you were cowboying up quite a bit today, man. Let me slide back over there with you real quick. But uh, cowboying up out there today, there's no doubt about it, man, because that sand, this track was not a smooth uh, smooth ride for you, I'm sure. No, it was pretty rough out there. I mean, uh, I knew it was going to be rough going into it. I just uh, paced myself and uh, sat back and just uh, let the track come to me. Take us through that race. You got off to what, about a fifth or sixth place start, man. It wasn't necessarily right probably where you could have or would have wanted to be, but like you said, you paced yourself. Right. It worked out good. I mean, as long as I'm in the top five, I'm happy. And uh, we got off to a good start there, probably top five, and just uh, tried to settle into a good pace. Got a little arm pump there at the beginning, just uh, being excited to be back. And uh, holding on pretty tight because Dusty couldn't really see the whoops coming up. But um, halfway in, I loosened up, and uh, the bike started coming around. Just everything started clicking, just uh, pace my, like I said, pace myself, work my way to the front, and do what I needed to do the last lap. I mean, uh, I don't know, I've been doing that pretty much all last year, so I know, uh, I know where to make my move. All right, this competition just seemed to be a little stiffer this year. These boys seem to be a little hungrier. Yeah, I guess we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> they sure gave you a fight for it, no doubt about it, man. Congratulations to you on this first win. You got the points lead. Uh, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's only going to get better for here. I'm sure that's what the plan is, huh? Yeah, I hope so. I mean, uh, just want to go one race at a time. I know I have a big bullseye on my back, but uh, it doesn't bother me. I'm just glad to have this number one and uh, represent it right. And, uh, just like I said, go one race at a time, see where we end up, and hopefully we can bring another uh, championship home for Suzuki. So, uh, See what we'll definitely see, man. It's all getting underway now. We'll go to Georgia here in just a few days. But who do you want to say thanks for for the big win today? Uh, definitely my mom and my dad, my girlfriend, my mechanic John, uh, brother, friends that came down, just uh, everybody that's been helping me this year uh, with riding and just having a good time. And uh, can't thank uh, Suzuki enough. I mean. Uh, don't have the factory back this year, but they were willing to step it up and give me give me a little bit of help. So I mean everything uh, everything works out. I mean uh, you expect winning a championship, you expect more, but uh, I understand all the budget cuts and everything. And like I said before, they uh, they've been with me two years, and uh, I'm gonna try to help them out and get through this, and uh, hopefully they can get me back and uh, go from there. But like I said, I can't thank them guys enough. Pat Alexander, Ryan the Blues, Nick, and all those guys, but uh, MSR, Rockstar, Suzuki, Yoshimura, Awesome Motors, uh, Henson Racing, Fox, Blingstar, XC Bob, Maxis um, Tires are working awesome, New Wheels, Douglas Wheels were awesome, uh, Shuey, and Scott Goggles, uh, uh, Motor X, Twin Air, uh, Walsh Racecraft, A Arms, Show Arms, working awesome, Fox Shots. So, precision stabilizers, but anybody I forgot, thanks for everything, and uh, we'll try to keep this thing going. All right, sounds good. Put your hands together, like ladies and gentlemen, Chris Borch. Before we get too much more into this, come on over here. We've got one order of business. Hang on just a second, and we're going to turn things over here to Mr. Jeff Russell. He's got something special for you. Thanks, Rodney. On behalf of Racer Productions, G and CC Racing, we'd like to present you with the championship ring from 2009. Congratulations, Chris. Great ride today. Thank you. I appreciate it. Well, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Show them some love. Your top three overall, Adam McGill, Taylor Kaiser, and Chris Morant. All right, a couple of quick orders of business that we got to, uh, to do here. One of those is, as Chris says this time, throw out some hats here, man. Some swag. Okay, there you go. All right, we got, uh, don't go too far. Let's get the trophies. Let's get up front. We need the photos with our trophies. 